In this video, we'll talk about burning a CD in Windows Media Player. After you create a playlist, as you did in the Create a Playlist video earlier in this chapter, you can burn that playlist to a CD or DVD so you can play your playlist on another device. Here's how. Click the Start button, and then click Windows Media Player. Create a playlist, as you did in the Create a Playlist video earlier in this chapter. Insert a CD into your CD-ROM drive. Click the Burn button. Windows Media Player burns your playlist to the CD using the default settings. If you want to remove audio files from the CD, be sure you insert a rewritable CD into your CD-ROM drive. If you want to change burn settings, click the down arrow underneath the Burn button. You can change the media you want to burn to, eject the disk after burning, apply volume leveling across tracks on audio CDs, and more options. The defaults are that Windows Media Player will burn to an audio CD, eject the disk after burning, and apply volume leveling. When you click More Options in the menu, the Options window appears and displays the Burn tab so you can change burn settings. For now, click the Cancel button. You can get more information about burning by clicking the down arrow underneath the Burn button, and then clicking Help with Burning, which sounds a bit strange on its face. The Windows Help and Support window appears with more information about burning.